So now for uh, this circuit here, we have an LED that is off when the light is bright enough. So my lamp is at its brightest setting. I'm dimming the lamp and you can see as it gets more dim, the LED gets uh, brighter right there. I can cover it or turn the lamp off. That's about its brightest setting. So the part of the circuit that uh, senses the light level is the uh, light dependent resistor here to the negative supply and then we have a pull up resistor to try to raise the voltage but uh, more light lowers the voltage that goes to the base, the middle pin of the transistor. So we'll scoot over here a little bit and uh, so where they come together over there comes to the base of the transistor there. I'm using a 2N2222. You could use any NPN bipolar junction transistor for this circuit, it doesn't uh, need much current. Um, but in uh, any case, the emitter is left pin, middle pin is the base, and the collector is the right pin. If you're looking at the front, emitter is the arrow, there's the base, and there is the collector. So you can see the flat side is to the right. So emitter, base, collector in my hands kind of going over the light pen resistor making it darker and the LED is getting brighter. So let's talk about why that is. So if it is uh, very bright, then we have a connection to ground that's basically zero volts. Where the emitter is will be zero volts uh, probably because whatever the voltage at the base is, it'll be about 0.6 volts lower. So it doesn't get to a negative voltage just if there's no voltage there, there's no voltage there. You have to rise about uh, 0.6 volts uh, before you start getting a rise above zero volts right there. Hopefully that makes sense. So in any case, it's like halfway bright or something, um, then you know we might have like 2.5, let's just do 2.6 volts to make the math easy. And uh, so you lose 0.6 volts. That'll be uh, two volts across the 220 ohm resistor. And uh, using ohms law, two volts divided by 220 ohms, that will be how much current uh, flows through this whole part right there. Remember, if you get a trickle of current through there, then you get a lot more current that way. But in any case, it will pass current as needed to hold that voltage to 0.6 volts less than what you got there. And since it doesn't really need current, it won't throw off that voltage. And if you got it like really, really dark, then you would have about 0.6 volts less than 5 volts. It would make the whole 5 volts at the base, if that got really dark, it'd be millions of ohms of resistance. And uh, thus we'd have like 4.6 volts or so across the 220 ohm uh, resistor, if we got it uh, really dark. So, in any case, that's about all there is to it. Thanks for watching.